Welcome to Forensic Detectors, friends. I am Dr. Cod, your gas meter gas detector, and today I am your cannabis, I am your cigarette, I am your smoke detector expert, folks. Dr. Cod, do you have a cannabis or weed smoke detector? I think someone's smoking in my hotel. I think someone's smoking in my rental, in my vacation, in my Airbnb. That's the type of phone calls Dr. Kuz is getting and has been getting for the past few years. And guess what, folks? That's right, Dr. Kuz responds. I'm not sitting at home eating my potato chips or watching Netflix. No, Dr. Kuz is thinking of the needs of the market needs out there and he's coming up with new innovative, innovative products. Look at this, folks. It is our cannabis weed smoke detector. Nice little white small unit. You just pop it on, the front button's there. You turn him on just like that. Oop, it's upside down. And it's a particulate matter, 2.5 micron smoke particulate cigarette weed detector. Extremely sensitive in detecting particles. That's what makes this superior, superior beyond your traditional $10, $20 smoke detector that you have at home. Okay, folks, look at this beauty. Digital screen at the front, power button. USB recharge and at the back it has the inlet vent. It has a little fan. It draws the air right through and it detects the particles with a laser via laser scattering. Very, very advanced, advanced technology which just only 10, 20 years ago would cost you thousands of dollars. Folks, miniaturization technology advancement at its best. Right here, small form factor and the price point is available for everyone to purchase so folks how do we use it this is the way we use it folks look dr cos again he's got another amazing product right here this is dr cos's little smoke uh it's a smoke generator folks and carbon monoxide generator <laughs> folks dr cos another little invention right here and it's going to come on the market too it's used to test products like this what's happening it has a little combustion generator inside and it produces a very small amount of smoke you could barely see it folks but this will pick it up you can't see it there it is you can't see any smoke coming out you can't see any smoke and take note of the of the value it's 11 11 okay folks micrograms per cubic meter and we there's a small amount of smoke in there coming out and we place it at the back there and you can see the numbers quickly increasing folks okay you could see that now you know there's no smoke you could barely i can't i can't even see it but i do know there's a small amount a very small amount and this little guy is picking it up and that's the way we use this cannabis weed cigarette smoke detector if you think someone has smoked in the room you take the unit you take a reference point in clean air could be a hallway could be another clean room okay it's 14 for example Take this guy, you walk into the suspected smoke room and you look at the value. If it's going up, bang, then you know someone, but someone was smoking. That's the whole point. So it's a relative, it's a relative measurement. Okay, folks, that's the way it goes. So very easy, very affordable and easy to undertake. So you don't have any concerns. Do I smell cannabis? Don't I smell cannabis? Is it cigarette smoke? Is it this? Is it that? Bah, 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 bah. No. Use this little guy, take the measurement Dr. Cos just described, and you're good to go. All right, folks, look, till then, be well, keep cooking those burgers for Dr. Cos. Stay safe. See you soon.